Storms in Nicaragua are wild and exciting. They reflect the country's grit, its untamed and isolated jungles that spread from the Costa Rican border in the south up to the border with Honduras in the north. People here live simply, and it reminds me of parts of Bali 20 years ago. Nicaraguans smile a lot, and the ghosts of the past years of political and social upheaval are seemingly forgotten in these somewhat isolated parts of the country. As surfers, we tend to disregard the stories that the news portrays about certain places in our pursuit of an exciting adventure. I remember seeing footage of the waves here years ago and knowing that I needed to come and explore the coastline regardless of what people said about the country. The allure of finding potentially empty A-frame peaks to feast on was too much to ignore. So finally, I've come for six weeks to see what I can find. Burgundy what? This is, it's Barrel, it's a, I can't speak because I've only had three hours sleep. It's too early, Santi. Wait, I'm not, yeah. We're going to get two for breakfast. <laughs> I'm so excited. I just can't hide it. Oh, I should start singing. Don't be beautiful singing. Little girl? Oh, it was so sick when I was paddling in. It was just this little one footer, and I just parked it, and it just grew and got thicker. And it was just so easy at that point. It just got me out of there. It looked like you claimed me, brother. What? Yes, 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 <laughs> no, yes. I didn't. Let me see. That's not a claim. That I'm is just, a claim. I'm balancing. <laughs> ah, no, 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 no. <laughs> just edit them down beside my body, and that's fine. <laughs> Good wave though. <laughs> Sometimes I feel nervous going to a new location without much intel. The expectations I bring sometimes don't match the reality of actually being there. But to be honest, Nika has landed right where I wanted it to. Bringing students here has been perfect because we've found empty, amazing ways for us to work our technique over and over again. Basically, more, more yes. situation where you've sort of shaved off a little bit of that angle. Oh. <laughs> the guys are giving me shit because they're trying to say that I claimed a wave. Nicaragua has a ton of interesting beach break and reef break setups. The reason the swell here is so characteristically peaky is because of a series of outer reefs and deep canyons 
that refract the swell as it marches toward the beach. Instead of powering in straight lines, the swell tends to be broken up into A-frames that, if you're lucky, produce an incredibly fun left and right wherever they land. At the beach breaks, it's rare for there to be a particular bank producing waves on repeat, but rather, you've just got to sit and hope to be in the right spot for one of the many TPs that roll in. It makes the surfs fun and engaging. The lineup is democratic, as it's not always the best surfers who get wave of the day, but rather that one lucky bugger right in the spot. been a good uh, few days so far. The guys are progressing really well. We saw a very visible up-leveling in skills yesterday and I'm expecting to see a lot more. Though the, the group leader is a bit of a pain in the butt. <laughs> Alright, well I need to, I think okay, we need a got, couple more people over there. As I've gotten older, my job has become more important to me spiritually. Many of the best moments of my life have been in the ocean riding waves and to help people achieve those peak experiences and to be a part of them is such an amazing privilege. For me, those peak experiences mostly come in the form of a good barrel. So when we saw the forecast looked favorable for a particularly fun A-frame beach break nearby, we scrambled the team together, jumped in the cars and went for a drive. We've just rocked up to the most glorious little beach break. A-frames, as far as the eye can see gonna have it all to ourselves so I'm absolutely frothing the crew are getting ready we're gonna have an epic session I'm so excited I'm gonna be surfing for quite a while so got the new signature zinc formula chocolate smells good doesn't it and it actually stays on your face throughout the session so I'm gonna mask up for this one it's gonna be sick oh, I just want to get some barrel For me, this session captures Nicaragua perfectly. Nobody around except us and an absolute feast of perfect little peaky barrels. I used to draw and dream about waves like this when I was 15. <laughs> now I just wish it was double the size, but I'm still stoked.
We've had the best time here. And as always, it's been the people along with the waves that have made it so special. Experiences like this last a lifetime, impossible to replace with material things or money. As surfers, the feeling of being totally satisfied and surfed out is what we chase. It's the relaxed nothingness that comes from knowing you completely and utterly soaked up every single moment in the day and can now rest easy as that day ends. I'll definitely be back to Nicaragua. If you want to join us next year on retreat, head to kalebrock.com to check out all our current experiences. You can also check out our new merch like my surf hats, natural zinc and technique queuing stickers so you don't forget what you've learned watching the videos. Thanks for being here. I'll see you next time.